Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to my trying a new makeup product everyday series. Today I am so excited because I got a really exciting package from Palladio. I love Palladio products. I have tried out a bunch of products that I picked up from Sally Beauty Supply a while ago. And seriously, some of my favorite lipsticks are from Palladio, so I was so excited to get this. So this is their new nude cream lipstick. Long wear liquid lipstick. It says transfer proof with matte finish. And that sounds like something I absolutely love. I love a long wearing lipstick. And it's actually funny because the Palladio and Casey Holmes lipstick collab, this was like probably years ago, was one of the first liquid lipsticks I ever got that didn't transfer. And I just didn't even realize that that was a possibility. And then once I tried out those, it like changed the game. Now I am obsessed with long wearing transfer proof lipsticks because it just makes it so much easier, less hassle, less worry. So I'm so excited to try these. So it says Palladio Botanical and Vitamin Infused Cosmetics, cruelty free, paraben free, vegan, gluten-free, clean beauty. So not only all of that, but it's also such an affordable brand. And that's something that I really enjoy and look for as well. So these lipsticks, let me show you, I've got four here. They retail for $7 each, which I think is such a fair price. But I do wanna give the disclaimer that this was sent to me for free from Palladio Beauty, but this is not a sponsored video. I am just so excited and so grateful to get this. So before I get into some swatches, I wanna give a little bit more information. So it says it's a lightweight formula that glides on smooth, transforming from a cream into a transfer proof matte finish that won't bleed or crack when dry. It's infused with shea butter and hyaluronic acid. Love that. Which will provide the lips with comfort and hydration for long wear. And they sent me four shades, which all of these shades look so beautiful. Oh my gosh, I feel so spoiled. I'll be swatching those. But they also sent me four masks that coordinate with each lip color. That is so clever. Because the thing with wearing masks, people can't see your lip color and they can't see your lipstick. But you can wear a coordinating mask to go with your lipstick. I just think that is so cute. So I love that. I am fully vaccinated and I have been for a while, but I still enjoy wearing a mask, especially when I'm going outside and I, I want that sun protection or I'm not wearing my full face of makeup, but I'm going out in public and I'm so used to wearing a mask that I wanna hide myself a little bit. So I'm still wearing masks, I'm into it. <laughs> But anyways, let's get into these lipsticks. I'm gonna start out with some swatches. And by the way, I have four shades here, but this comes in eight different shades. So I will, of course, have this linked in the description down below. So if you don't see your perfect nude shade, check out the site because it might be one of those other colors. But first, I'm gonna start out by swatching the shade called Nakey. <laughs> it's such a cute name. Ooh, and I love the little doe foot applicator. Ooh, that is a beautiful shade. Ooh, it smells really good. It smells like candy. Oh, that is very nice. The next shade is called Skin. I am loving this formula. It definitely seems lightweight. I love this color as well. You know, I think I'm gonna love all of these shades. The next one is called Nude. Oh, beautiful. Seriously, I love the smell of this. It smells kind of like a fruity, sour candy like a sour watermelon patch, kind of, is what it reminds me of. And then this shade is called All Natural. Okay, seriously, these shades are gorgeous. Here are what those swatches look like. 
But seriously, like every single one of these shades, I think would be a great nude for me. I am definitely going to wear all of these, but for today, how about I try doing a little bit of an ombre lip using a couple of the shades. Hmm, maybe I'm gonna start with the one on the end and the second one in. So the darker one on the end here, this one is called Au Naturel. <laughs> and I'm gonna start out by applying this to the outer section of my lips. You know what, I, I'm just gonna fill in my entire lips and then I'll go over it with the lighter shade because it kind of went a little off center. I love this formula though. It's very thin, very lightweight, but so pigmented that it reminds me of paint pretty much going on my lips. I love this color, such a gorgeous mauve tone, so flattering. I feel like as far as a nude lip goes, this one's a little bit more bold, a little bit more glam on me, but I love that. But then just to give a little ombre effect, lighten up the inner section of the lips, I'm gonna go in with the shade Skin. I mean, really any of the lighter shades would work for this. Just placing it in the center there. Rubbing the lips together. And then blend it out a little bit. Okay, I love that combination. That gives such a beautiful like kind of plumping, enhancing effect to the lips. Like it's like a subtle, almost tricks the eye type of color combination. Oh my gosh, I love that. And the formula does dry down, but it doesn't feel at all dry and uncomfortable on my lips. It has those moisturizing, nourishing ingredients, and I can tell that it is super moisturizing on my lips. My lips look smoother even color, doesn't cling to the dry patches, but it has a beautiful matte finish. So let's see if there really is no transfer. Yes, no transfer. Love that. Love this formula. Love the colors. Let's see like if I, yeah. So you can see no smudging at all. Seriously, long lasting but so comfortable. And these shades are just perfect. It lifts up to all of those claims. And for $7, you can get that with these. So I really do think that all the shades work perfectly together to get an ombre lip. And for $7, I do recommend picking up multiple shades so that you can get that ombre effect or wear each color on their own. I'm just so excited about these. I love them. So thank you so much to Palladio for sending me these. If you have tried these out yourself, definitely let me know your thoughts on them in the comments down below. Also, I would love to hear some tips in the comments down below. Like I love to do an ombre lip by putting a lighter shade in the center, but if you have any other tricks like that, like color combinations that you like to do with your lipstick, please let me know in the comments down below because I wanna try out some new lipstick, lip hack type of tricks. Well, thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day. And I will see you tomorrow in my next video.